and um, can't recommend that enough. Speaking of which, we gotta get. <laughs> <laughs> doing it oh it's early today all right to anybody in denver who lost their portugal hat yesterday i found it on my run don't worry i washed it for you but in the meantime we're gonna put it to use you better believe it shout out to everybody who watches the vlog in portugal let us know down below in the comments with your portugal flag do you watch in portugal thank you so much it fits. It fits like a glove. All right. We're doing it, buddy. We're doing it, everybody. Okay, here we go. Gnarly nutrition today. We'll talk about this in a minute. But in the meantime, here we go. Taking out, finally, the heroes, everyone. The V6s, okay? There they are. New Balance Hero V6. Soak it in. Soak it in. There's that outsole. Oh man, these guys have been a long time coming, but we're finally getting them out of the barn into the pasture. All right, come on. Kind of cool with it. it's all smoky. It's awesome. It's all cinematic. Now usually I ask you what shoe you're running in, <laughs> but I'm gonna save that for now. We'll ask on the way up. What drink are we drinking today? Cool. I'm gonna go with the uh, gnarly uh, fuel 2O. Okay. And I'm going with the cherry cola flavor. Okay. Pretty big fan. And um, now, how do you spell gnarly? <laughs> <laughs> G N a-R-L-Y. Okay. Now for everyone outside the United States who maybe doesn't understand the English of gnarly, <laughs> like the... Uh, Why it's spelled that way? Well, it's just like the, the slang that gnarly is. Oh, yeah, yeah. Gnarly is just kind of the, like radical or cool or extreme, hardcore. Yeah. They uh, recently came out with a new kind of marketing, branding, and their symbol is on uh, the rock on symbol. So nice. That probably means something across the world. So hopefully I didn't just offend, uh, <laughs> globally offend. But woo. And the big question is how much filming gear am I going to bring today? Found this uh, Portugal hat on my run in Denver yesterday. Oh, nice. <laughs> I washed it. That's sweet. It's clean. I washed it. But uh, if anybody lost a Portugal hat, I will give it back to you. Actually, I just remembered something. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Whoa! <laughs> Sweet. So, oh, thank you. This is Soar out of the UK. Oh yeah, I've heard of Soar. Have you? I've yeah. never heard of them until today. They do uh, like or the until recently. checkerboard kind of patterns. Yeah. Yeah, nice. Path projects. Sweet. I have too many hats. I have, th it gave me three hats. Dang. Cotopaxi. Oh, nice. Oh, fanny pack. That's sweet. Right? Oh, nice buff Ooh. from Jaybird. Dang. I mean, this is score. I'm not even Christmas. I'm not even kidding. Like, this is off. I just. Jeez. It's just insanity. Well, yeah, thanks. It's just insanity. <laughs> I would send this out to everybody, but, like, I can't afford the shipping. <laughs> yeah, it's like, not, so not right now. Joseph gets. <laughs> I'm not even kidding, man. And cool. anything Joseph won't use, he'll, he'll give away to someone. Yep, other runners. Sun 
Porcupine, everybody. Porcupine. He's not messing with us, but we're not gonna we're not gonna mess with him. Got a brag for a second. You guys just ran up La Plata with the FKT holder. <laughs> I was on Fastest Known Times a couple days ago and I was like, who's got the FKT for La Plata? <laughs> this guy, what is it? One? About 112. 112? Yeah. About six minutes ahead of another guy that's very fast. So. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was a fun one. Got to mention real quick, uh, gnarly, three weeks into testing and last week, 26 miles, 7,200 feet of vert up and down Pikes Peak, no stomach issues. So, so far so good for me. And I think, what were we saying on the way up about nutrition and like just testing? You just gotta find like what... Yeah, absolutely, yeah, super personal. Yeah. Definitely suggest, you know, trying it out on training runs. Don't use your new, you know, nutrition for the first time. Yeah. Um, uh, on race day. Yeah. Try it on long runs, workouts, super important. Mm-hmm. But yeah, that's one of the things I love best about Gnarly. Doesn't hurt your stomach. It's been good on the stomach so far. So, pretty amazing. But, time to cruise. <laughs> Cherry cola. Oh, Delicious. so good. Wrapping up the run, just talking a little bit about soccer, AKA football. Yeah. Uh, we're gonna do some strides and then break down, break down a little nutrition action. And yes, we are natives of Colorado. 
<laughs> we got we got to be proud of that. We're back. Got the strides done. This those felt good. Definitely. Stretch out the legs a little bit. Yep. I forgot to ask though, what shoes you were in today? I was in the uh, Sockney Peregrine Tens. Peregrine Tens. There Older you go. Peregrines. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, yeah. Pretty uh, pretty good shoe. Good grip. Good grip for sure. Yeah. Would have liked to do the uh, uh, Mad Rivers, but <laughs> yeah. No, that's Blew those out. That's fair. And uh, forgot to mention also on top. We are starting to plot some FKTs in about two weeks, so stay tuned. Yeah. We still got to think about which ones we want. But today, what do we got in the bag here, Joseph? We got uh, some Gnarly Nutrition. This is their new Fuel 2.0. And uh, it's kind of a new product line this summer from Gnarly. And yeah, we tested it out today up on La Plata. Yeah. Um, yeah, what'd you, I don't know. What did you think? How was your... So for me, it has what I love is it has calories. Yeah. So that's like, I got to give a shout out to Courtney DeWalter, one of the best ultra runners in the world. I remember in an interview I heard a couple years ago, she talked about how she used to drink Gatorade uh -huh. when she just got into ultra running. Oh, wow. Yeah. Because it had calories. Yeah. So I have found like a lot of sports drink mixes don't always have calories to burn. Yeah. I think that, no, that's huge. And I mean, this product really in a lot of ways can replace your gels um, and those calories are super important. Before we get too far, I'm going to let Joseph ask the question of the day because um, and because it's like it's important to dial in your and you were saying on the way down as you get older, what were you saying? I think, it, yeah, I guess it's, you know, uh, part of getting older, but you just have to have your nutrition dialed in order to perform well. I've had too many days bonking or just too many days not performing as well as I would have liked. And then especially the recovery, yeah. which we can talk about a little bit more. But um, recovery is so huge, especially, you know, getting up there a little bit in age. And <laughs> you, uh, you got to recover well in order to train I, well. I got five stuff. years on him. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Question of the day is, what is your go-to, I guess, training nutrition or race nutrition? What do you use when you're out on the trails? Big days, you know, ultra running, trail running. Yeah. Um, whatever you're whatever you're out doing what's your go-to and like why did why that why, why that one yeah why that specific product yeah all right what else we got in here yeah so this is probably my favorite and stay tuned maybe we'll get a separate review sometime of this these are bcas um, branch chain amino acids i think super important for recovery yeah and then i've got two different proteins this is a Ooh. vegan vanilla flavor protein and then this is whey uh, whey protein for anybody who's um, not vegan. What about this guy? And then this is that. collagen, which I've just started using. Um, it's pretty good for, you know, like your joints and your tissues, soft tissue stuff. So yeah, I know it's a little bit wild. Um, I've definitely kind of just gone all in on gnarly the last couple years. And yeah, just from personal experience, it's, it's the best that I've found. Now I've switched over a little bit, everyone from Bobo's <laughs> to overnight oats. Could I mix in some uh, vanilla plant? 100%. Protein? Yep, 100%. That, I looks, do, that looks tasty. I do protein in my overnight oats. I do smoothies and, uh, and uh, you know, all kinds of goodies. Yeah. With the uh, protein. I'll even put BCAs in my overnight oats, which is a little bit wild. It's This is a, a berry lemonade so <laughs> nice nice Some pizzazz but yeah i love all their products and uh, i think it's an awesome company treat their uh, people super well so and listen this is not this is not a paid promotion or anything we're just like we are yep. he's been testing for two or three years um so he believes in it and that's why we're putting it in the vlog i wouldn't just be putting anything in the vlog and it's been working for me so far for the last three weeks and i'm going to keep using it as i get ready for pike's peak um, yeah, we'll just see what I end up using for, you know, that race and, but anyway, so far so good for me. And, um, can't speaking, recommend that enough. Speaking of which, we gotta get, <laughs> <laughs> this is live everybody. <laughs> oh man, that's my bad. Um, I'm going tropical for my recovery here, even though this might not be recovery, but, um, you guys know DGR, I don't know, I'm not on YouTube very much, so I believe in this, <laughs> I believe in this product, that's why. We don't have great cell service up here, so I'm just going to put a comment of the day on the scre screen right now. Uh, I'll pick one. We don't have good cell service, but I believe it or not, we're going to close it out. Do you have a, uh, a vlog you want to 
throw it back to an throw old back to? old mountain vlog that you jumps jumps out oh, at you. Man. I'm putting him on the I'm putting him on the spot. On any the spot, any old run or race. Or... Yeah, the one that just came to mind was our running last summer on uh, Loveland Pass with Steve. Running on that's a good one. On uh, Loveland, maybe we'll toss it to this this run up on Loveland Pass right here. Or we could also do Huron Peak too. Oh yeah, yeah, that was fun. Yeah, Huron or the uh, Belford one. Sorry, Steve. <laughs> <laughs> nice. All right, everyone. Seek beauty, work hard, and love each other. See you tomorrow. Tomorrow, YouTube.